zippity doo da beautiful day, great to be alive. Hey, what's up everyone? This is Chris Brown here again. Now, as you can see behind me, I'm filming this video from inside the Gaylord's Palms Resort. Now, as we've been talking about throughout this series of videos, we take part in different initiatives to help to really spur on the local business community. Now, throughout the years, the government has used a portion of your tax dollars to help finance billions upon billions of dollars of market research. Now, again, most businesses are either not aware of it or even if they are aware of it, most of them are not taking advantage of it. So, again, you spent your tax dollars, so you want to get the most out of the money that you spent, right? Now, the reason that this is so helpful is between the year of 2011 and 2012, let's say that you are a landscaper. Between those years, the landscaping industry dropped $4 billion. Now, this money is still being spent. It's just shifted in the way that it's being spent. So, instead of hiring landscapers to go ahead and do the projects, a lot of these individuals have now retired. And so, now they're wanting to do do-at-home projects. So, you know, stores like Home Depot is doing really well. Um, there's also people who are offering landscaping courses and gardening courses, uh, either through YouTube or just selling books and courses of that sort. Um, so the, this $4 billion is still being spent, it's just being spent in a different way. So if you don't know this, you can't make the shift in your business to be able to capitalize and, to be able to capitalize and adapt to these changes. So you have companies like Netflix who pretty much bankrupt Hollywood Video. You've got Borders Bookstore, which was pretty much bankrupt by Barnes & Nobles. Uh, you have Circuit City that was pretty much bankrupt because of uh, Best Buys. And uh, because they did not adapt to these changes, uh, this market research was available to them, but in most cases, they did not utilize them. So even though that they had access to it, they did not take advantage of the opportunities that they had. And companies of that sort have all types of billions upon billions of dollars themselves that they can go ahead and finance their own market research. So again, you have to be smarter than your competitors. So if you look down below directly underneath this video, you'll find the resources that will link to the governmental websites where you can gain access to all of this research. Take for instance, most of us realize that most businesses fail, right? Now, it's not always due because of money problems because so many times what happens is a lot of businesses fail because they are just so overwhelmed due to all the responsibilities attached to running their business. So they, they fail because of becoming overwhelmed. Now, the research shows that 80% of businesses fail within their first five years, and those are startup businesses. Uh, we also show, it all, this research also shows that 97% of businesses fail within 10 years. However, because of this research, we have $1.5 billion in research of what all the world's most successful companies have in common. So in addition to the research that has been provided by the government and all of these government financing, so in addition to the research that has been provided you with you here, what we've also done is we've taken a lot of this research, packaged it up into a way that is easy, accessible, and understandable for you. So if you take this research, this $1.5 billion of research of what all the world's most successful businesses have in common, you apply it, that will increase your chances of success. And we're going to reveal what some of these things are throughout this series of videos. So I want to encourage you to pay attention to your email over the next few days. But uh, again, if you look down below directly underneath this video, you'll find all the resources, everything that you need uh, based upon the stuff that we've talked about in this video. But I hope this information was helpful. I had a real enjoyable time filming this video for you today. Hope you got some value out of it. But take care, everyone. Have a great day, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye now.